Hi, I'm Bennett with Noria, and we're on a mission to make the world a better place through lubrication excellence. Today, I'd like to talk to you about oil analysis programs, in particular, how you can avoid the top reasons on why they have failed. Oil analysis programs, or simply OA programs, can sometimes be a blessing and a curse. A blessing in that they can provide a huge return on investment. A curse in that they can easily fail to provide those returns if they are not managed properly. One common way OA programs fail is because of a misguided strategy with when to sample. Deciding when to draw a sample is one of the most important decisions you will make with oil analysis. The most important thing to remember is to sample routinely and consistently enough to expect to catch the anomaly before it escalates to a serious issue. And don't simply take a sample when a problem is suspected. This means you must follow a strict schedule with when to sample when things appear normal and sample maybe more frequently when there is an indication of a declining machine condition or a declining lubricant condition. Secondly, OA programs are commonly known to fail due to a lack of essential information provided to the lab along with the sample. One of the most useful techniques in oil analysis is detecting deviations from a trend. And without this proper information provided with the sample, you won't even be able to build that trend. Laboratories often receive samples that lack this necessary identification to help them associate them with the previous sample analyzed. If you have not created an effective way to group every sample taken from a particular sample point, then you will fail to build that trend, thus challenging yourself with the ability to detect any crucial deviations. The last reason that comes to mind why OA programs fail is an overconfidence in the lab's summary of analysis in the reports. Each oil analysis report typically comes with a brief summary of the results, and because of this convenience, it is sometimes the only thing that is read. This summary may be useful, but is by no means conclusive. This is because the diagnostician who created the summary is not an employee of your plant, therefore not familiar with the machine in question. Having someone who is familiar with the machine and can interpret the report in the context of the machine's day-to-day -day environment and running conditions is essential. If you're looking for more information on how oil analysis programs work and what their success tools are, visit machinerylubrication.com. There you will find hundreds of articles and videos on this exact subject. Also, give us a call or visit us at sanori.com to learn more about our specialized oil analysis program developments and how we can help you.